What's up everybody, Unrested here with J News with Gaijin Views. Today we start our story with Judo from Judo Dreams of Sushi. That's right, the famous sushi chef is talking to the Japanese government about his worry of overfishing. He says in the future he worries that if they continue to overfish, they may have to start making sushi out of products that are not actual fish. That means artificial fish flavored food, which sounds absolutely disgusting. Um, I hope that they do get on that if that is something that really is a huge problem. There has been discussions back and forth. I have not researched it well enough to make a direct comment as to if I think it is a legit complaint or not. Judo probably knows a lot more about sushi and overfishing than I do, so I will refrain from commenting. Moving on, kind of a sad fact in today's news, 40% of the Japanese youth, according to the Health, Labor, and Welfare Board of Japan, rely on their parents for an income. Now, that doesn't sound so bad. Everybody got a little bit of an allowance here and there. Uh, maybe they dealt with a little bit of money from their parents or gifts during the holidays. But here's the disturbing fact. When I read into it further, it said Japanese youth, and it said ages 15 to 34. 34. Guys, if you're 34, you're not a youth anymore. Um, just a heads up there. Uh, it's time to move the fuck out. I mean, don't get me wrong, everybody falls on hard times. I'm not saying you don't ever get to move back to your parents' house. They are your safety net for a reason. Um, but at 34, it's time to be your own woman or your own man. Um, you need to move out. You, you, need to, you need to find a job. Yes, you do. Um, now, I realize there's many different circumstances, everything from disabilities to all different types of social anxieties. I'm not making any kind of excuse for that. I'm not trying to say it's bad, good, or anything in between. I'm saying normal, able-bodied, working human beings at the age, past the adult age, they don't necessarily even need to go to college. At this point, I kind of wonder why I ever went to college. But you do need to get a job. That's just part of life. I'm sorry. It's a hard, cold fact. Um, at 15, I mean, I can't really rip on 15-year-olds. I definitely got an allowance when I was 15. Um, you know, and I was lucky to have that. Uh, I probably complained it wasn't big enough at the time because I was a spoiled teenager, but, uh, you know, a 15 including that, but I'm not really sure why they went past the legal age of 20, which is an adult in Japan, and were like, that's still the youth. Um, 34, you need to grow the fuck up. Uh, last but not least, uh, a bit of a strange story that at first I thought it was ending on kind of a happy note, but it turned in kind of a diabolical one at the end. Tokyo scientists have come up with an invisible mouse. They can now inject the bloodstream and tissue samples of the mouse in which to turn the body invisible. The reason for doing so, they state, is to research things like tumors and cancers, gross diseases, and other things like that moving through the body while the mouse is still alive. The problem is, when they do this as of now, they have not found a way to keep the mouse alive. So that means it dies when they do this. That's uh, kind of an animal cruelty situation right there, if you ask me. Um, you would have thought they would come up with a plan to keep it alive if their thing was to watch its living state in its invisible form. Um, would they ever be eventually able to do this to humans? Wow, that would be freaky. Dark Man, anybody? Oy, 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 oy. Or no, Hollow Man, not Dark Man. Come on, don't get your Kevin Bacon stuff mixed up. Kevin Bacon the bomb, man. He saved that town. Now they can dance. Anyway, guys, until next time, I am unrested. This is J News with Gaijin Views. If you like what you saw here today, please like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time.